What's up? It's Olivia, and today I'm doing. Hey, what's up? It's Olivia, and today I am getting ready for the Met Gala. I'm so excited. Come get ready with me. Let's go. I um, drove in on my tour bus from Canada to be here tonight, and I'm gonna do the Met, have so much fun, and then we're gonna drive to Boston. So um, yeah, we sandwiched it right in between two shows, but there's no place I'd rather be. It's a, it's a very exciting life. <laughs> We like to listen to music while we get ready and Clay and Lily here have really great taste in music and so I always ask them to play me their favorite songs and so I get my makeup done and I get a little music education, so win-win. We listened to a lot of Charlie XCX mm -hmm. before an event. That's good hype music. Yeah. Great hype yeah, music. Hype listen to Marina before we go yeah. out. That's that's the kind of stuff that you like listen to before you like go on a date or something and you feel really confident. So works the same with the red carpet. <laughs> I feel like I'm really drawing from Hollywood's gilded glamour and over the top opulence, rich colors and sparkle and just have that ethereal, dreamy, magical look, but still with a rock star edge. And I also have like minor baby synesthesia. So when I listen to songs, I'll like see colors and lots of the songs on Sour are purple, like Driver's License is purple. But good for you is like a purpley blue. Jealousy, jealousy is like bright red. Deja vu is like orange and pink and light purple. I was gonna say deja vu is orange. Yeah, yeah. it's like lighter, more pastel-y. And I like having purple as the cohesive color throughout my whole sour era. She hasn't had that purple moment yet. And yeah. It's her favorite color, so it just felt. Yeah, it felt. We right. actually haven't had a purple moment. Mm -hmm. That's crazy. We're saving it. I love Versace so much and. If you look at my Pinterest, it's just like so much archive Versace and I've just always been obsessed with them. Um, and so I really wanted to wear them for the Met and I'm so happy that I could. And we sent them um, some of my favorite like archive pieces and kind of just um, ideas uh, for uh, the Gilded Age theme and we kind of came up with it together. We've just finished the liner and it's so pretty. Lily did such a great job. Um, and now I'm moving on to the skin. Mm -hmm. I woke up with these like lovely three pimples on my forehead, um, which happens and it's okay. But uh, Lily's gonna do her best job at my covering magic. them up. But also, <laughs> it is what it is. Everyone gets pimples. For the hair, I kind of was inspired by like the Gilded Age and like silent film era movie stars where they would have like these big brushed out waves, especially when they would like take down updos. So I wanted to do sort of like that, but um, a teenage rock star who's hot. The dress is not here yet. What time is it? The dress is coming in 10 minutes. I just took a nap. I'm so tired. I've been on tour for the past few weeks, so I just took a 20 minute nap and I'm chugging a matcha. It's gonna be great. I'm gonna feel super energized. Ciao. I feel very confident about the dress tonight. It feels very me. It's like sour purple color, and uh, yeah, it just feels very, very Olivia. Uh, clean Chanel butterflies. Oh, I like this too. Let me ask five. What about just the one side? No. I've always loved butterflies, but. You have to love it. I know. You've got to go with the butterflies if that's what you love. I know, I love it so much. <laughs> We're just about to head to the Met. I'm so nervous, so excited. We haven't truly decided on the headpiece yet. We're going to decide in the car, but that's fashion, baby. We are en route. Um, butterflies have gone in. Feeling extremely nervous and extremely excited.